To anyone dreaming of ambling through the cobbled streets of Montmartre, running the windswept steps of Mont Saint-Michel or kayaking through France's answer to the Grand Canyon, the Gorges de, de Louise in the south of France, it might soon be a reality. Here's a helpful guide on what's open, what's not and what you need to travel. France currently has a relaxed border with seven countries around the world Australia, South Korea, Israel, Japan, New Zealand, the United Kingdom and Singapore, which it brought into effect on the 12th of March. The country is widely believed to be opening on the 9th of June to international travelers for non-essential travel. If the country opens on the 9th of June, it is not a given that it will be open to everyone. At the moment there is an EU-wide safe list, where travelers are allowed to visit the EU, if their country has under 25 cases per 100,000 people. The EU is expected to announce an enlargement of this list of countries soon, increasing the list to include countries where the case rate is under 75 cases per 100,000 people. The EU has also asked its member countries to allow vaccinated travelers to visit but it is up to individual countries to decide if they will use additional travel restrictions. For instance, requiring additional COVID-19 testing or quarantine. For the non-vaccinated, many countries have been deciding unilaterally when to open borders over the past few weeks, some doing so before EU-wide decisions have been made. For example, Greece has already opened to all travelers. Some decisions are confusing because they are not yet reciprocal Spain open to UK travelers on the 24th of May without quarantine, but Spain is not on the UK's safe list, meaning that British people cannot travel to Spain without quarantining upon their return. France will determine which countries can visit based on infection rates, vaccination rates and new variants. A cause for concern, for instance, is the so-called Indian COVID-19 variant which is rising in the UK and has reportedly delayed the wider EU decision on expanding the safe list of countries. As of the 26th of May, there is a plan to enforce quarantine measures for all UK arrivals into France, for instance, to protect against the spread of this Indian variant of COVID-19, the B1.617. There will be a traffic light system in place, most likely launched before the 9th of June. It will most likely be linked to data from the ECDC, which has been operating a traffic light system of infection rates since the start of the pandemic. Jean-Baptiste Lemoyne, Secretary of State at the Minister for Europe and Foreign Affairs told Europe One, regarding countries that are outside the European area we will work on lists and colors. There will be the green countries, orange countries and red countries. When pressed, Lemoyne hinted in mid-May that there were only five or six countries on France's green list at that time. Travelers will prove they are in good health through an EU digital COVID certificate.